So prostaglandins are produced in the outside part of the cell. That part of the cell is, is damaged by drugs, prescription drugs. Alcohol can, uh, can damage the cell, and that can throw off prostaglandin production. In fact, a lot of the effects of a hangover are really the effects of damaged cell membranes. Some of the effects, anyway. Not a lot of the effects, but some of the effects. Vitamin E is especially protective of a cell membrane. In fact, that's vitamin E's main role in the body, to protect fats and fatty membranes. Not just cell membranes. Anywhere where there's a membrane, uh, inside a cell there's membranes. And on the outside of the cell there's membranes. And vitamin E protects these membranes. And vitamin E protects all fats, actually. It protects essential fatty acids. If you're taking your ultimate EFAs, make sure you're taking some vitamin E with it. If you're, taking, if you're eating a lot of fat, fatty foods, make sure you're taking vitamin E. Make sure you're taking vitamin E anyway. 400 IU a day is a, a great place to be. Vitamin E is well known as a brain and nervous system vitamin. If you're dealing with Parkinson's disease or other movement disorders, Bell's palsy or any kind of palsy issues, ataxia issues, movement disorders of some kind, vitamin E can be very helpful. Alzheimer's disease, other dementias, vitamin E can be helpful. MS, myasthenia gravis, Guillain-Barre syndrome, all of these, uh, all of these involve the fatty membranes of nerve cells, and you'd be wise to be using 400 IU, a 400 IU daily dose of vitamin E if you're dealing with any of these kinds of issues. NAC, NAC, N-acetylcysteine. NAC is another supplement that can protect cell membranes. So can turmeric. Super powerful. Turmeric is in the cell shield product. Turmeric's amazing stuff. So is NAC for that matter. So is vitamin E for that matter. Using 500 milligrams of NAC in addition to 400 IU of, of uh, vitamin E uh, and turmeric. Using them before you go out uh, at night or using them for a couple of days before you're planning on going out and drinking alcohol. Maybe coming home and doing some more NAC can be very helpful when it comes to reducing the severity of a hangover, even preventing a hangover entirely. You can probably get uh, the same kind of protective benefits if you're drinking a lot of coffee, if you're drinking, uh, using caffeine, eat, drinking a lot of soda pop, or if you're using prescription drugs, especially if you're using prescription drugs. If you're on multiple prescription drugs, you guys, you are crazy not to be using a nutritional supplement program. If you're taking more than one prescription drug on a regular basis, it is absolutely foolhardy not to be on a nutritional supplement program that features vitamin E and N-acetylcysteine, not to mention the B-complex and vitamin C, which are all protective against, uh, protective against the toxic effects of prescription drugs and that can help you clear out prescription drugs out of your body. This is one of the major, major roles of uh, of uh, nutritional supplementation to protect the body from toxins and nothing is more toxic than a prescription drug. Nothing. You have to, you have to go out of your way to, to swallow mercury or lead in order to get the same kind of toxicity that you get with a prescription drug. Yes, I know you're only using milligram amounts or microgram amounts sometimes of prescription drugs, but nonetheless, gram for gram, the toxicity of a prescription drug approaches the toxicity of any poison you can name. 